Assalamu alaikum, my name is Muhammad Ali Raza and welcome to my YouTube channel Marketing Chamber where I talk about Klaviyo ML Marketing and Figma ML Designing most of the time. So if you have not subscribed my channel, so please do subscribe so that you can get updates about my updated tutorials. Okay. So let's get back to the point. So in the class six of our Figma ML designing series, I discuss about the effects in Figma, uh, like inner shadow, drop shadow, layer blur, background blur, with some live practice and some tips also there. So if you have not watched it out, so go to my YouTube channel, Marketing Chamber, and then playlist Figma ML designing series. Okay, so in this tutorial, in the, our seventh class, so we are going to discuss how to remove background in Figma and how to crop or what are two methods uh, using which we can crop the image in Figma very easily. Okay, so let's get started. So the first one is how to remove background for free. So for that, let's have some image here with some background. So then I will discuss with you how to crop, uh, how to remove the background. So to have image, uh, to upload image or to import image in Figma, so you just have to press Control plus Shift plus K, okay, and then go to the resource folder where you have that image. So suppose I want to import this image, so click here and open. And then you have to click on uh, like on your Figma, uh, like uh, what you can say frame, where you want to import it. So suppose I want to have this image here, so I will click here. Here you can see, and you can uh, resize, you can uh, by just pressing shift and drag using the left button of your mouse. Uh, let's have it here. Okay. So now to remove this back, remove the background. So I will go here, resource tool, then plugins, and then you can search remove uh, background. So here you can see, you can find different plugins there. Some are paid and some are free. Uh, but for sure, I am going to show you the free uh, plugin using which you can uh, remove the background. So here it is. So I will click on the drop down, remove background. So then you have to sit back and wait for the few seconds so, so that it can remove the background for you. In the meantime, uh, you can share your feedback with me about the Figma email designing series. So here you can see the background is removed now. So doing the same uh, method, doing the same steps, you can remove the background very easily. Okay, so the second thing that we have to discuss how to crop image in Figma so there are basically two ways that I use. So let me share with you. Okay, so just press Control Z so so that we can have a complete image here. Okay, so what is the first method? So just click on the image, and then you can see a crop image icon here. Click here, and you can see the handles across your image. Like here, you can see. Okay. So then what, you, what to do? So just drag the image using the left button of your mouse. Like which section you want to crop. So drag that section and you can crop the image like this. Okay. And if you want to uh, like undo the chaining, so just press control Z like this. And what is the second method? Click on the image like this and then press control and the same drag it using the left button of your mouse here you can see and suppose after cropping the image later you think like you want to restore the crop image section cropped area so just go to that image click on the image and press control and again same drag it using the left button of your mouse and you can restore the complete image and you can restore the cropped area very easily like this okay so i have discussed how to remove the background using the plugin how to crop image using the first method uh, that was using the crop image icon and then the second pressing control and dragging 
dragging with the left button of your uh, mouse and how to restore the cropped area. So you have to go back to that image and press control and drag it uh, using the F button. Uh, so doing so, you can uh, restore the cropped area also. So that was our short tutorial, uh, seventh class, but there was something to learn. Uh, so please don't forget to share your feedback with me. How is this course going on? Uh, and this will push me to create more valuable content with more pace. And don't forget to subscribe my channel and share with your friends. Stay tuned. Stay happy. Thank you.